All right, Devon, thank you so much for joining us, talking a little bit about the 2020 NBA draft process, things a little bit different this year than in years past for obvious circumstances. How are you preparing for the draft, not having the ability to do the you know, combine, in-person workouts, things like that right now? Yeah, it's different for sure. Uh, it's not the ideal um, you know, draft process, but uh, I'm taking it day by day, uh, taking it very seriously, uh, keeping my body in shape, um, whether that's eating right, um, just, 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 just pushing myself to be the best version of myself um, right now. So um, I'm focusing on, you know, my shooting, the outside shot. Uh, it consists of to hundreds and hundreds of reps a day. Um, just getting, getting my body and getting, you know, my game ready for the next level. So, it's coming off your second season at Kansas, 18 points, four rebounds, four assists, two steals. Again, one of the top teams in the nation, your first team All-Big 12, your second team All-American. Personally, what did that program do for you as a player and as an individual as well? Um, I mean, yeah, the program, Kansas helped out a lot. Uh, just playing under Coach Self, uh, learning from, from him, uh, playing at the high level um, on that stage every day, um, every game. I helped out a lot, prepared me for the next level, uh, whether that's uh, my competitive drive, um, learning what it takes to win, not not just winning, but you know, the, the, the little stuff it takes to win at a high level. Mm -hmm. um, I think just just that, you know, drive and, and that will to, to, to do something special um, helped out a lot. And uh, it was a special season. Um, and so, yeah. You declared for the draft last year, went back to Kansas. Where do you feel like your game made the biggest jump this past season compared to your freshman year there? Right. Um, I mean, yeah, going through the process last year, um, I learned a lot. Applied it to my off season this past season. I uh, learned. Um, I, I mean, I focused on my shooting, outside shot. And then I think it's a big one is my leadership, uh, mm -hmm. the ability to, to run a team better, I think. Um, my sophomore year, I did a great job of that, controlling the game, um, picking my spots better, and just just having a just that there being a second coach out there on the floor, um, and being there for my teammates um, was, was key. And um, so I think those are areas where I, I really improved, made made the next step in my game, and uh, I'm just continuing to try to get better. Um, I'm just a just a sponge that that just wants to continue to push the envelope. I know you didn't play with him, but you and Devontae Graham have a lot of similarities in terms of position, size, things like that. What was kind of the influence that he his season this year had on you for your game? What do you think about the way he's kind of elevated since coming out of Kansas and going to the NBA? Yeah, I mean, honestly, I, I was just super proud. It's just, I mean, just it's cool to see. Um, just seeing making that jump. Um, just seeing uh, the way – um, he, he goes about things. Um, I know he, um, he, he works hard. And, uh, just coming from Kansas, the, those, those point guards and, and the, the rich tradition that, um, that Kansas um, has from, from the point guard perspective. And, um, it was cool to see, great to see. And, um, yeah, so. Looking at the Charlotte Hornets roster, a lot of young guys right now, rookies, second year, third year guys are kind of the core of this team. How could you see yourself potentially fitting in with them? I mean, yeah, so Charlotte um, is, is along the, the younger side. Uh, they have a lot of young pieces and um, a lot of, a lot of um, you know, guys that, that are hungry to get better and uh, trying to shape the culture. I think with me, um, with my quickness and my speed, I I can change the pace of the whole game. Um, I can I can defend at a high level with my with my quickness. Um, I can I, mean, I I can be versatile on the court and I can play off the ball on on the ball. Um, when it's needed for me to score, I, I can do that as I've shown this year, leading the Big Twelve in scoring. Um, and then also um, I can run a team. So um, I try not to be one dimensional. I try to you know expand my game. So. Um, I can see myself in it nicely. Lastly, you are a Charlotte native. You grew up playing. You went to Providence Day before Kansas. Just personally, what would it mean for you to play for the Hornets in your hometown city for the team you grew up watching? I think I think it would be uh, kind of a dream come true. 
I just, I mean, I, I went, I've been to many games, um, countless amount of games. So just you know, uh, playing for your city, playing um, just in front of your home hometown uh, would be an amazing feeling. Um, I would just, 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 just cherish every moment, cherish every opportunity I have, and really make the most of it.